some things a lot different this year. Uh, we started preseason late, you know, intentionally. We had a lot of injuries the last couple of years, so we tried to do things differently and get a late start to try and um, not have as many injuries. Uh, we're going to change our offense. We're going to change our defense. Uh, we have four returning players from last year's team and nine new players. And I just say, the biggest problem is, hey, you know, they're going to have to do what I expect them to do, and they're not going to be around. And if we can stay away from injuries, then we'll be fine. And so, you know, we feel like that um, we're in the pool. We're in the pool, Landy. We're in the pool, and we can freestyle. We can backstroke. <laughs> you know, we can butterfly. You know, we can do several things. You know, so sometimes it's not just getting in the pool. You got to be able to do more than one thing. And I think that's, that's what this team here can do. They can do several things if we can keep them together. Chill. Uh, good afternoon. Um, so our university is in a transition, and I promise, I think I said that last year. Um, we do have a new president, uh, Dr. McLaurin, um, and things look very bright for Shaw University. And also in athletics, we have the captain back, uh, Al Carter, uh, who took a leave of absence from athletics for a year. Uh, and, and myself and my team are very excited about that. Um, however, my team uh, is not in transition. We have a team full of six seniors, um, and it, it all starts and it ends with Raheem Smith, um, the other five seniors, David Jones, Jamar Lagier, um, and Daryl Johnson. Uh, it, it'll come down to an old cliche that you're only as good as your senior leadership. Um, outside of that, we are just trying to get our newcomers to understand uh, our philosophy and how we do things on and off the court. Uh, we look to have a good season with that. Coach Curtis, any names of any players that we need to look for? I think Janelle Harrison is back, but she's not bad on my own. Maybe she's back. <laughs> any players that we need to look for? Oh, a lot of players to look for. Oh. If we the reason I said it because she averaged like 10 points a game for you last year. That's why I brought her name up. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> But we're going to be different this year. So the four players that we got coming back, you know, to me, gonna be, they're going to be in role players next year. So, I mean, we have, you know, Demario Lyles, you know, who's a um, tremendous player. She was um, Junior College National Player of the Year. Um, we have uh, Jackie Sanders, who I transferred in, um, Ashley Williams. Uh, we got a lot of kids coming in. We're going to be pretty good. We should be pretty good. Coach Hill? How do you talk that? You know? <laughs> <laughs> Raheem Smith, we know, right? Raheem Smith for sure. Anybody else to look for this season? Um, well, actually, Raheem's cousin, Tony Smith, was pretty good um, at the junior college out, out west, out in the uh, community college is pretty good. Um, and also, a uh, hometown guy from Raleigh, David McClenny, um, 6'9", transfer from UNC Wilmington. Things looking good for Shaw University, both on the mid side and the lady side. Oh, definitely. Real good. Real good. Real good. Real good. John Curtis, Cleo Hill Jr., Shaw University. Thanks, guys.